if a man breaks into your house at night and he's he's a he's a home invader but he's also a sexual deviant and he points a gun he said your choice i'm gonna rape you or your wife which is the lesser of the two evils <laughs> you see the problem i s u p k Hey, Shalom, man. It's Priest Kevin in the Dawn Hall with the ISUPK. On the Commander Journey in Atlanta in California, man. To like all blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians. Subscribe to this channel, man. You want true salvation? You gotta learn from the priests and prophets of the ISUPK, man. Subscribe to that channel. Hit that button, man. You understand with that? One. Trust in America. Give me, give me Isaiah, give me Isaiah 31. And, this, and this, this is our problem. Black people as a whole, we always say we're gonna vote for the lesser of evil. Can we can we vote for damn righteousness? Can we vote for something righteous? Like you like you like how about how how, how about no evil? The, listen, brother, I'm not I'm not attacking you at all. A lot of black people say what? Who we, we when it comes to voting, we say we're gonna vote for the lesser of evil. How about voting for right, something righteous? How about voting for no evil, man? Evil, evil, is this, evil, dest evil destroys our lives. E evil is murder. Evil is rape. Evil is drugs. And guess what, that's what all the white men put in our community, is evil. He is evil. Joe Biden and Donald Trump had the same bloodline. They have an evil bloodline. They are the devil the Bible speaks of, man. They are evil. Vote, vote for Christ. Christ is a righteous man. Christ is a black man. Christ, the ISBK, since 1969, guess, guess who he, since 1969, guess who we voted for? Christ. Because that's the only way to go, brother. Listen, no Democrat. Brother, let me ask you something, right? You you said, and this is not an attack on you. I've heard this from since I'm coming up, both for the lesser two evil. If a man breaks into your house at night, and he's he's a he's a home invader, but he's also a sexual deviant, and he points a gun, he said, Your choice, I'm gonna rape you or your wife. Which is the lesser of the two evils? <laughs> you 
you see the problem? You see the problem? That's the problem right there. No, he said it jokingly. But that's, listen, that's what elections is. Elections is a people who, remember, they voted for Abraham Lincoln. They voted for George, they voted all the way through while we was in slavery. They voted to keep us in slavery. When you go to vote, voting for the lesser of two evils makes no sense. It's like negotiating who gonna get raped, you or your wife. How about nobody getting raped and I ain't voting for you? You understand what I'm saying? No That's what I'm you not, think. I'm not voting for Kanye. Hold up. <laughs> That's the, give him a hand, though. Listen, that's the best answer a brother in the world could give. There is no one to vote for. But so you think. There is somebody to vote for. And he, listen, he already, he already won the election. I vote for a lot of people on the island that I would do that. Listen, I'm going to tell you who you should vote for. Your King Jesus Christ. Right. Man who promises to bathe America in the blood of the white man for what they did to your forefathers. Right. That's who you should vote for. Listen, and in, in Christ there, there ain't gonna be no, no lesser two evils. <laughs> white people just gonna experience right, evil. <laughs> you gonna experience being sold, being whipped, being lit on fire. You gonna get exactly what you gave to us. And th there ain't no ballot boxes for that. See? You had some bad thoughts. See? The Lord exposed it. You was thinking some bad. You, you, you was thinking some bad. Listen, that's for letting your wife get rid. <laughs> listen, I guess, and guess, and, and, and the brother, and the brother was so right. Like we, we gonna vote, we gonna vote for the lesser two evil. But guess what? In the Bible, you got prophets who always, who always fought for their people. What did Moses do? Moses, Mo, Mo, Moses went to eat. Moses went to the Pharaoh. Said what? Let my people go. Moses was fighting for us. Christ, and the, Christ, he also fought for us, black man. You got we, you got to fight for somebody. We got to vote for somebody and choose somebody who and choose somebody who is vote, who who will do something for us. Cause, that, Cause that's what that's 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 what choosing a king is. That's what that's what voting. Usually when people vote, they vote for somebody who who will benefit and help out their community. No president has helped out our community at all. But Christ will help out our community. You know what? Having the spirit of Christ. If we, if, if black people walk around in the spirit of Christ, we will help each other out. We will stand for each other. We will, we will look at each other as individuals. We will know that we have, we, that we all have a common enemy. And since we have a common enemy, we gotta band up together, man. Right? And that, and that does not mean band up and shoot and kill. That means band up and stay, stay inside of a community together. That means, that means band up. No matter if you're a black celebrity or poor or whatnot, you're gonna look. You're gonna stay together with your people, man. That's, right. That's what that means. That means you know what? I'm not gonna let no black man, no Latino man, be poor. I'm not gonna let no black man sleep on the streets. I'm gonna say no. You know, you know what, brother? Come and lay in my house. We're not gonna let no black man, no Latino man, go hungry. If all black and Latinos gather together and walk in the spirit of Christ, we will die for each other, man. And guess what? These they don't, those the white man, the Chinese, they respect that. How come America don't go just just don't go to war with China? How come America just don't, just, just does not go to war with Russia? Because Russia will stand up. Russia will fight back. China, the Chinese will fight back. Black man, we gotta stand up too. And what I mean is not what I mean is not getting a gun, but stand up and watch the Lord what the watch the Lord destroy America, man. Because vengeance belongs to God. It ain't no, it ain't no destruction that we can cause, man. But what we can do is, what we can do is band up together and fight for a call and, and fight against the evil that a white man do to us, do to us, and not help him out. If you are Christian, you helping the white man destroy our community, man. If you Muslim, you helping the white man destroy our community. I, I, I know, I know, I know, job, I know we don't have any jobs right now. But if you selling the white man drugs, you helping them destroy us, man. We gotta be stronger than we gotta be stronger than that. I know it's easy to sell to sell some weed. I know it's easy to sell an O or, or, or QP or a quick hat or a pound. It's easy to do that. But guess what? It's gonna harm us, man. A lot of the easy ways that we do is harming our community. But if we if we choose if we choose the hard way, it'll protect our lives forever.
trying to find something to follow Had loyalty, every man tried to borrow Felt pain and a lot of sorrow Got betrayed, so packed, I didn't even have my heart broke Living confused, about to lose hope Cops got me on the side of the road Like a sideshow, need an antidote before I croak Now I'm setting fire to rhythm man blues Call this guitar smoke Rebel with no cause, trying to find direction The world got me vexed Picked up a bad lick, a habit that's hereditary from oppression Felt like my life was on fire, trying to find an exit Now look, 10 G's plus a good wreck Sometimes a follower is a soldier Trying to find a good ship Plus when you in hell, how do you excel? Wisdom the breath of life, I don't believe in fairy tale Listen well to what I tell No calling can cause pain Something that a rebel knows very well can't you tell I was sent from the Lord? Got a tongue like a two-edged sword. With a